I bet you'd be surprised to learn a popular fast food chain is teaching some big and important lessons to law enforcement. Turns out some police departments are taking a page out of their customer service handbooks. News 5's Catherine Ross explains how a Cleveland company is getting involved now to bring police and community rate relations together. All right, you said it's spicy to get that one to this mock right? From the greeting. You have a nice day, thank you. To the handoff, the Charlotte, North Carolina police chief says a dinner stop in 2020 turned into something bigger. I just happened to have a, a, a run in to drive by uh, Chick-fil-A to get something to eat with my wife. And that experience alone right there, the customer service that they presented to me was enough to take my mind off of everything else that was going on. The interaction happened as tensions flared nationwide between law enforcement and communities in the wake of George Floyd's death. Chief Jennings wanted to bring a taste of his customer service experience to the people his officers serve. In their minds, they should be thinking that how can I leave this interaction with a positive impact? He enlisted customer service experts at the DeJulius Group to help it tailor its training for all employees. The Cleveland-based agency had never worked with law enforcement, but says people skills boil down to courtesy. Right. We're not saying when anyone's life is in danger, you should be saying certainly in my pleasure. And, you know, the customer's always right. I, I've never agreed with that. Right. But you, you could you could be human first, a professional second. Um, you could show empathy. The model is beginning to catch on. Westlake is one of several police departments in Northeast Ohio adding customer service to its mission. We're dealing with people who are calling the police department for a reason. We want to make sure we empathize with their problems and what they need, and we want to provide that service for them. Cleveland State Diversity Institute Director Dr. Ronnie Dunn has researched police community relations for years and found officer demeanor to be a top complaint fielded by the Cleveland Civilian Review Board. He thinks a focus on customer service is a step towards better relationships. This is how you begin to build and lay that foundation to improve that relationship. And it's about building mutual respect and then trust. CMPD has started tracking customer satisfaction and found it increased from 43 to 84 percent since its customer service training. Chief Jennings says the approach only works if departments commit to a culture shift. You know, the commitment is going to take a lot of time. Uh, it's going to take a lot of effort. And uh, unless you're willing to do that, uh, you're you're not going to be successful. In Cleveland, Catherine Ross, News 5.